Welcome back, everyone. It's the Bourbon Judge. And we're back at it with the 2024 Michter's Barrel Strength Rye. Yes, the brand new limited edition, and I am I'm thrilled. <laughs> but hey, before we dive into this, a um, couple updates. So first and foremost, March Madness. I can't believe the game is tomorrow. Championship game, we will see who will win. Um, I know for my patrons, I did a contest, a really cool contest. So someone's gonna win a you know full bottle and a, it's actually a surprise. I'm not even gonna, I almost slipped. I almost slipped, but one of my patrons is gonna win a full bottle of uh, something that's in my um, in my collection. And let's just say that person's gonna be extremely excited when they uh, receive this bottle. Uh, speaking of patrons, uh, we were actually kind of working on, we kind of have it's almost like a, a collaborative type of a, a discussion, right? In terms of like our barrel picks that we have planned out for 2024. So um, we're working on our barrel picks. We've obviously already had a, a whole bunch that just released. We have others coming up and I have some other ones in the queue right now that I haven't even told my patrons about that they're gonna be shocked. They're gonna be extremely, extremely excited when I announce some of these uh, new ones coming up for uh, the second half of the year. All right, let's get back to uh, to Michter's. So when you think of Michter's, Michter's is probably, it's they're definitely one of my favorite brands. I mean, I, hey, it is what it is, right? You like certain products, it's just it's the way life is, right? So Michter's is a brand that has always worked well for me from a palate perspective. I've always enjoyed just, you know, everything that they have, their American whiskeys, their rye, their bourbons, just a brand that I've always honestly kind of gravitated toward. And especially when it comes to like these limited editions. But hey, I have to offer judgments that are not biased, truly fair judgments, regardless how much I might personally like the brand itself. But when you think of the brand, you know, Mixers, they're honestly, I mean, they're doing a lot of great things. They're winning awards. I think even last year, for example, they won an award uh, for like the world most admired whiskey uh, as a whole. You think of the team there, you have Dan McKee, the master distiller, you have Andrea Wilson, the master of maturation. So think about like the barrels as they, as they mature, uh, the whiskey ages and so forth. She kind of handles that whole process, the toasting of the barrels and so forth as well. But this brand, I mean, they are just, they're doing it right at the end of the day. They are doing it right. Great downtown Louisville experience. So if you ever have a chance to go on a tour, make sure you, uh, if you get to Kentucky, make sure you check out uh, uh, Mixers as well, right downtown Louisville. But this is their 2024 Barrel Strength Rye. So the last time they put this out was actually back in 2022. So I'm really excited they this came out here for 2024. It just came out actually, honestly, just literally this month, just dropped. Um, when you think about Michter's, their Barrel Strength Rye, um, so this is truly a single barrel. So it's a single barrel. So each and every barrel, like when you find it in the store, your proof is probably going to be slightly different than mine. So my barrel comes in at 110.4 proof, but your uh, barrel might be somewhat different. Now they, they do say that the average proof for uh, the 2024 Mixer's Barrel Strength Rye is about 110.2 proof, right? Uh, but again, my barrel comes in at 110.4 proof. I'm going to go ahead and get to the nose real quick. So people ask all the time, Judge, what's your barrel number? Just want to see whether or not if, you know, if you happen to have the same barrel. So my barrel number is 24 B as in boy 0977. So 24 B as in boy 0977. All right, let's get into this. So Judge, what is the price on this lovely 2024 Michter's Barrel Strength Rye? So the price, honestly, when you think about the quality of this whiskey, uh, at least historically, price is actually not bad, honestly, especially this day and age with how much whiskey prices are going up. So I'm actually kind of happy that uh, Mixers is keeping the MSRP at a normal price point for the most part. Uh, so this is $110 on the dot, $110 on the dot. All right, let's get into the nose real quick. Oh, my, 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 my. Mm -mm -mm. I opened this and poured just like a smidge out the other night in my infinity uh bottle oh gosh the nose on this is just it's it's amazing honestly <laughs> what i love about the nose so you know obviously mixers does a really good job of like toasting their barrels and so forth but because they use like a lower entry proof, they use 103 versus the standard uh, across the industry is about 125. Um, it's a little bit more expensive to do that, but it just creates, I don't know, a better quality whiskey, at least from my perspective. And it brings out so much, so many more like different like notes as a whole. So for this one, which I'm loving, it's at the core of a rye. 
you get a ton of like pepper, but what I love about mixtures as a whole, I've always said this, I've said this on numerous occasions, it reminds me of like a campfire experience. So it's definitely a, a rye at the core, definitely very peppery, a little bit of mint as well, but you get some um, really notes of like, great notes of like uh, caramel, almost like a burnt, kind of like an orange peel kind of a note. Caramel, burnt orange peel, Oh my gosh, a little bit of leather, a oh, little bit of chocolate, mm. and like that whole marshmallow graham cracker kind of a note. Oh gosh, all right. Hey, we did not come here to nose whiskey, we came here to sip whiskey. Let's go ahead and get it in. Hey, real quick, three quick easy favors. Number one, hit the like button. Number two, drop me a comment, let me know what are your thoughts on Michter's Barrel Strength Rye. And last but not least, please make sure you also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell so you get a notification each and every time I release new content. Cool? All right, here we go. Cheers. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> the judge is... I'm speechless right now. I'm speechless. Wow. Wow. Okay. Let me get a little bit more. Let me get a little bit more. Whew. Okay. Here we go. Cheers again. Mm. Wow. That's 110, but that actually sips like it's like 115, 117 which I actually like, you know, I like that a lot. <laughs> Everything from the nose transfers to the palate, and I love that. Everything from the nose transfers to the palate. Um, the one thing that's in there, you know, of course I had like that, um, almost like that burnt orange pill note, that was in there, the, um, the, the caramel, the leather, the chocolate notes that were in the nose, to me, I think kind of almost like just from an explosion, they exploded in the mid back of the palate. So the chocolate notes just kind of blew up. So it was almost like a chocolate, uh, burnt orange peel, caramel kind of a note. That my friends, at $110, to me folks, while it's definitely harder to find a Michter's Barrel Strength Rye, this is one, the 2024 edition, this is absolutely special. And I mean, flat out special. This is one where, hey, you might put a little bit of work into it. Ask some friends, hey, if you're out hunting, if you find the Mixer's Barrel Strength Rye, grab it for me. I'll shoot you some cash back via Venmo or PayPal or whatever. This one, I'm telling you folks, is absolutely flat out amazing. That is a buy each and every day. This is absolutely special. And like I said earlier, to me, it sips almost like it's 115, maybe even 117 proof. It definitely sips above its proof point. So this is one, you say, Judge, if I'm out hunting or my friends are out hunting, should I ask them to grab it for me? Uh, the answer is pretty easy. Hell yeah. <laughs> Until the next time, my friends. Peace, cheers, most important. Salute. See you guys.